Tang Katz and Peter Yona. Tang Kat and Peter Yona are two local terms related to rice farming. A Tang Kat is a plot of land used for rice farming that was originally part of the Albufera Lake. After purchasing or leasing a section of the lake, a Tang Kat is created by demarcating the plot through the creation of a dike built up above water level. Then more muddy earth is added, taken from a shallow area of the lake until the area is filled in and level with the neighboring fields. All of this arduous work was done with great effort using rowboats, hoes and grass baskets. Once the tankat was isolated, it was possible to control the water level inside it by using mechanical pumps, which were originally run by steam engines. Most of the rice fields in the nature park are on lands taken from the Albufera over the years in the 19th and 20th centuries. The rice growing cycle in the Tancats begins with the Perayona, which is the time when the sluice gates are closed on the inlets and canals where water from the Albufera is released to the sea. By retaining and raising the water level on the lake, the Tancats can be easily flooded. This flooding of the fields enables the salt to be taken from the soil, thereby avoiding the germination of weeds during the growing season and controlling any possible infestations. The Perayona takes place between the 1st of November and the 1st of January, at which time the gates are reopened, the fields drained, and the soil is worked and prepared for planting. During the Perayona, the entire marsh is flooded, providing shelter for numerous bird species that winter here. <laughs> 